This video show you how to use ACDP to make BMW BDC2 all keys lost. Note, the BMW BDC2 hybrid car does not support all keys lost. ACDP cannot clear the EMEISN. In addition, BDC2 all keys lost need DME EEPROM file. Please read the DME EEPROM data first, and then operate the BDC2 module. Open OCDP app. Confirm in top right that a CDP programmer is bound. Click BMW. Click DMEISN. Click Bench Mode Read or Write DMEISN. Click Bosch DME. Click G. Remove DME. Click on the Help for B48 MG1CS003 SPC5777. According to the help document, to connect the ACDP interface board and engine computer properly, click B48 MG1CS003 SPC5777. Click Read EEPROM. Click OK. Click Continue. Click OK. Save EEPROM data. Pay attention to the path, date, and time of the backup file. The file name should end with EEPROM. Bin. Click OK. Reading chip data finished. Click OK. Click OK. Return to the BMW main menu bar. Install the DEM back into the car. Click FEM BDC. Click IMO mileage. Click BDC to ICP plus OBD F or G chassis. Click add key, all key lost. Click help. Connect the ACDP to the car OBD2 properly. Click Identify Vehicle Info. Click OK. Click Continue. Click OK. Save the vehicle data. Click OK. After verifying the car info is correct, screenshot and save it. Click Continue. Check if the IMMO is support. Click OK. Click OK. Remove the BDC2 module and dismantle it. Connect the ACDP device and BDC2 ICP interface board to the BDC2 module. Click Obtain Keys Data. Click Step 1, Read Coding Data. Click Continue. Click Continue. Click OK, Save Coding Data. Pay attention to the path, date and time, carve and num of the backup file. The file name should end with coding, bin. Click OK. Read coding data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click step 2. Read key data. Click continue. Click continue. Click continue. Reading keys data. Click OK. Save BDC to keys data. Pay attention to the path, date and time, carve and num of the backup file. The file name should end with BDC data. Bin. Click OK. Click Continue. Click OK. Click Continue. Read BDC2 keys data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click Step 3. Write coding data. Click Continue. Click Continue. Click OK. Select coding data. According to the time and carve and number, select the coding data file ending with coding bin. Click Continue. Write coding data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Go back. Click Add key, all key lost. Click Step 1, Backup Coding Data. Click Continue. Click Continue. Click OK, Save Coding Data. Pay attention to the path, date and time, carve and num of the backup file. The file name should end with coding, bin. Read Coding Data Finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click Step 2, Backup FAFP Data. Click Continue. Click Continue. Click OK, Save FAFP Data. 
pay attention to the path, date and time, carve and num of the backup file. The file name should end with FAFP bin. Click OK. Backup FAFP data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click step 3, write IMMO data. Click continue. Click continue. Click OK, select BDC2 keys data. According to the time and car VIN number, select the data file ending with BDC data, bin. Click OK, save IMMO data. Pay attention to the path, date and time, car VIN num of the backup file. The file name should end with lost IMMO, bin. Click OK. Verify that the IMMO info is correct. Then take a screenshot and save it. Click continue. Click continue. Write IMMO data finish. Click OK. Click step 4. Write coding data. Click continue. Click continue. Click OK. Select coding data. According to the time and carve in number, select the coding data file ending with coding bin. Click continue. Write coding data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click step 5, make dealer key. Click continue. Click continue. Click OK, select the IMMO data saved in step 3. According to the time and car VIN number, select the file ending with lost IMMO bin. Click continue. As in the figure, connect the BAV key adapter to the ACDP. Put the blank key into BAV key adapter. Click continue. Reading key data. Check that the new key is an unlocked blank key. Click OK. Arbitrarily select an empty key slot. Click continue. Click OK. Click OK. After make the dealer key, Use the BMW BDC2 keys learning bench platform. Put the new key into the platform coil. And hold down the platform start key for 15 seconds to learn the key. You can also use the BDC2 test platform to test the key keyless and remote on bench. After learning the keys, load the BDC2 module onto the vehicle. Or after make the dealer key, you can also first install the BDC2 module on the vehicle and learn the key through the induction coil on the vehicle. Finally, write the DMEISN data to the OBD and clear the transmission data. Connect the ACDP to the car OBD2 properly. Turn on ignition. Click step 6, write DMEISN. Click step 1, unlock DME. Needs to read the DME original EEPROM data in first. Click Continue. Confirm that the DME status is locked. Click Continue. Select Load Data Get Password. Click Continue. Click OK. Select the DME original EEPROM. According to the time, select the file ending with EEPROM bin. Click Continue. Unlock DME Data Finish. Click OK. Click OK. Click Step 2, Write DME Data. Click Continue. Confirm that the DME status is unlock. Click Continue. Please select the IMMO data saved in Step 3. Click OK. According to the time and car VIN number, select the file ending with lost IMMO bin. Check if IMMO info is correct. Click Continue. Click Continue. Write DME data finish. Click OK. Click OK. Go back. Click Step 7, Reset EGSEWS. Click Continue. Confirm that the EGS status is unclear. Click Continue. Select Load Data Get Password. Click Continue. Click OK. Select the DME Original EEPROM. According to the time, select the file ending with EEPROM bin. Click Continue. 
Empty module data finish. Click OK. Click OK. BDC2 all keys finished. Verify whether the remote control and smart functions of the new key are normal and whether the vehicle can start and shift gears. Thank you for watching.